How long have you been in the neighborhood? Ato Gallery opened its doors in April of 1996, and we're now into our 15th year. Um, what is your favorite thing about the West Queen West area? Well, my favorite thing about the West Queen West area are the different shop owners uh, in the neighborhood. I find that they are a creative and energetic entrepreneurial group that help define the spirit of the neighborhood. What makes the West Queen West neighborhood so unique? Well, other than the shop owners, I think the, uh, the CAMH, the Center for Addiction and Mental Health, uh, I think the patients uh, help define the neighborhood. I find it quite ironic where you have the CAMH patients on one side of the, or in the midst of all of this cool and hipness on um, West and West. So I really like that dichotomy. What made you decide to set a business in the West Green West area? Well, you know, it, it seems like a natural trajectory to go westbound because you know, back in the 70s, Queen West became uh, synonymous with art and culture and hipness. And uh, that's where a number of uh, galleries started way back when. And so, like, again, it's a natural progression to go west. And uh, this neighborhood was really ripe for uh, a renaissance. I think it first started with Artscape, uh, which uh, is an artist uh, live uh, projects uh, building just um, across the mechanic factory lot. How has the area changed in the past 10 years? Well, in the last 10 years, there's been a lot more development, especially some of the condominium projects that have gone up. That and uh, the, the different bars and restaurants, such as the Drake and the Gladstone, have made a significant uh, impact on West Queen West. And, uh, and so, obviously, there's a lot more people coming down, and so hopefully that translates uh, into uh, sales. But certainly, we need to have more retail space available. And I think when CAMH has finished this uh, project, uh, they will for sure have many thousands of square footage for uh, retail space right on Queen, so that will help dramatically. How do you see the area changing in the next 10 years? Well, obviously it's going to become a lot more dense with the uh, with Cam H and the development of the uh, various common projects. And so obviously there'll be a lot more people living and working in the neighborhood and that just creates more of a street traffic and I find that an exciting part of the neighborhood where you could walk down the street late at night and there'll be dog owners and people coming out from restaurants. And so I, just, I see more of that. I want to make sure that the, uh, the artistic component, especially artists and art galleries, which help fund and ignite this renaissance have, uh, are going to be considered in the grand scheme of these developments that are going on. Wine or beer? Beer. Batman or Superman? Batman. Dinner in or dinner out? Dinner in. Chocolate or vanilla? Chocolate. Coffee or tea? Movies or music? Music. Cats or dogs? Dogs. Ninjas or pirates? Ninjas. Zombies or vampires? Zombies. Apple or orange juice? Orange. Summer or winter? Summer. Facebook or Twitter? Facebook. Swim in the pool or swim in the sea? Sea. Star Wars or Lord of the Rings? Neither. Colin O'Brien or Jay Leno? <laughs> uh, Lennon or McCartney? Lennon. Marilyn Manson or Marilyn Monroe? Monroe. Homer or Homer Simpson? Homer. PC or Mac? PC. 
party all night or sleep all night? Sleep.